Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today just a quick little video. Many of you asked me, Bobby, where did the happy, healthy, vegan video go? Right? I did a video on Ryan from Happy Healthy Vegan, but the video is not online anymore. I was wondering, I was researching, where did that video go? It's not like I have total control over my YouTube and I can actually see what is going on. I have no idea. Hmm, maybe I should listen to Ryan and let him tell me what is going on. Um, okay, I've seen a few people eat like your grandpa. Did I copyright strike Bobby's video? No, I did not copyright. Uh, maybe YouTube did that to him. Um, so we're wondering if we filed any copyright strikes. No, we didn't file any copyright strikes on anybody. So I'm going to be perfectly clear about that. And that goes against what fair use is all about. And saying it's fair use because they make some, um, you know, slanderous comments about you while they're doing it. All right, there you have it. Trustworthy Ryan tells us he didn't file a copyright complaint. That's good. That's cool. That's reassuring. Let me check my creator studio. All right, here we go. Happy Healthy Vegan. What I eat to become a middle-aged woman. Hmm. The video has been taken down. Hmm. But what is that? A copyright claim. Hmm. How come? Was it YouTube? Maybe it was automatically. Just by YouTube, like Ryan said, right? So, there you go. Copyright claim. By YouTube, right? By YouTube. That's not your name. That's not your email. Ryan. Benevolent Ryan. The only reason why you are talking about fair use is because I filed a counterclaim, which said the use of the video material, pictures and audio qualifies as fair use under US copyright law. This is a non-commercial critique video which does not negatively affect the original content. It is thereby completely within fair use guidelines. Right? The only reason why you talk about that is because I wrote you that email. On top of that, I contacted you personally. I wrote you an email. You did not respond. You say this is not personal. It is of course personal. You're absolutely buttered. But let's proceed with your little video, shall we? Yeah, so if you want to get back to your anti-vegan friends and let them know what's going on, tell them not to take it personally or anything like that. So if you want to call that a copyright strike, it's not, you know? You can twist things and if you're talking about him, he's known to lie and distort the truth. So I wouldn't, you know, trust anything he says. He's the one that says I'm degenerating, I have no athletic ability, and so on and so forth. So, you know, I think I've proved that wrong. Don't trust bad Bobby, right? Bad boy Bobby. He distorts the truth. He is the liar. Should we rewind again? Did I copyright strike Bobby's video? No, I did not copyright. Uh, maybe YouTube did that to him. Um, so we're wondering if we filed any copyright strikes. No, we didn't file any copyright strikes on anybody. So I'm going to be perfectly clear about that. So no, we didn't file any copyright strikes on anybody. It is absolutely pathetic, absolutely disingenuous. This is how you make a living, Ryan. You are critiquing non-vegans. You say it yourself. There's certain ways you can like reuse other people's content like I do. When you see me respond to an anti-vegan like say Joe Rogan or someone who quit being vegan, if people want to comment on content like we do, taking little bits and, and commenting on that, that's cool. And like I do. And like I do. But now you have the audacity to file a copyright claim when somebody critiques you. And on top of that, you have the audacity to lie to your viewers whilst wearing a real shirt, right? How deceptive. This live stream was about you becoming a politician. And let me tell you one thing, you're on a great path. You're a deceptive liar, right? You're lying to your audience. That is a great trait for a politician. No, we didn't file any copyright strikes on anybody. To my dear viewers, don't worry, I have a second channel which is posted in the description box where I will re-upload Ryan's video. This won't go without consequences. The copyright claim was striked by you and therefore I already filed the response. The video will be reinstated. Everything is within fair use, Ryan. You know that and I know that too. And on that note, you know exactly that this game can be played by two or by many. How about those other people that you made videos on? How about they go to your channel, right? Not saying anything, but 
could that be a possibility? For all the people that you slandered, for all the people that you talked shit about, for those people to get to your channel, Ryan, and to copyright claim their videos. And like I do, and like I do, and like I do, and like I do, and.